Alright, what's happening everyone? It's Abdallah, back again with another episode of Fire Emblem. On our previous episode, we started off Eliwood's chapter. Um, we found out that his dad has gone missing. Eliwood's on a quest to go save him. Uh, we've got a couple team members. We've got an archer. We've got a pre-promote named Marcus, who I'm not going to use. We actually came across Dorcas again. And he had a buddy named Barter, who is also another um, brigand, axe-wielding guy. Um, and we also have a guy named Lowen, which is a, um, a, what is that, a cavalier? Yes, yes, cavalier. Anyway, so we've got a, a good small group. Um, Elowit's pretty cool. He's got a rapier and he pokes people with it. So let's, let's continue on. Uh, after speaking with the village magistrate, Elowit and company set their sights on Laos. The road from Ferre to Laos passes through Santa Ruz. Elwood suspects his missing father must have visited Santa Ruz en route to Ostia. Elwood arranges a meeting with the local ruling lord to see what he can learn. Alright, so going to Santa Ruz. Alright, chapter 12, Birds of a Feather. Hmm, I wonder what that means. Santa Ruz Castle. What? Elliwood is here? Yes. He has set up camp on a hill south of here. He seeks permission to enter Santa Ruz. He seeks an audience with you. Could it be? Do you think Elliwood's come to ask of his father? If that's the case, I... I know not what to tell him. Tell him you know nothing, and let him be on his way. Yet... I know young Elliwood well. His father, Albert and I are old friends. I have no children of my own and I've always treasured Elliwood. I do not believe I could look him in the eye and I could not lie to him, I could not. We have no choice then. Let us chase the boy away. If you do not speak with him, you need to tell no lies. Wait, do you mean to harm Elliwood? Not harm, frighten. A scratch or two will leave no scars. He will run home to Foray and be done with his adventure. He is, after all, all that Foray has left. Oh no! Hmm, who is that guy? Instead of entering Laos with such a small group, we should meet with Marques Santaruz and request his assistance. I see the sense in that. It's a pl it's a good plan, Abdallah Nation. Truly so. I tell you again, I'm pleased to have you with us. Lord Hellman. He's not only my father's friend. I've known him since I was a child. I'm sure that he will help us. What? Lord Elliwood, beware. Whoa, Lance guy's and an axe guy. Who's this fat guy? Hey, 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 noble sirs. Alms for a poor villager. Poor villager, you look nothing like an honest man. Clear the road. Step quickly, or... Step quickly. Eh, eh, eh. Good advice. Maybe it's you who should follow it. What? Someone wants the boy in an early grave. A shame if you ask me, but he'll die here today. Come on, boys, earn your keep. Oh, wow. Talk about come on, boys. Here we go again. A hey, Abdallah Nation. Just like old times, seems our fates are bound. Natalie? Oh, she's still in foray. I'm working for you this time, so she's not too worried. Guide my axe, Abdallah Nation. Wow. Okay, let's look around, shall we? Um, you have... What is this? It's a vendor, so I gotta find out what's in there. There's a house there. There's a house here. There's plenty of houses all the way around. Um, this looks like nothing. Maybe some people will come out of here. I don't know. It looks like some sort of gate. Um, here's a village, so we'll go up to the village. Um, we got some guys, there's another house that we'll visit, some archers. It looks like we can split up into two. Um, one, one of our, or maybe two of our guys can go up this way, and then maybe a couple guys can go this way. But it looks like, um, mountains and peaks, they'll have to be able to cross over mountains and peaks, and this guy can. Um, but I don't know if my other guys can, so we gotta watch out. So pretty much, I think what the Barbarian, these little guys are going to do is they're going to walk over the mountains and then down, down towards the bottom. So I think we're not going to split up into two. 
and we're just going to go all the way up north. Uh, one person covering the back and one person pretty much covering the front, the bulk of everyone towards the middle. So let's go over the bosses and who's all here. Uh, Zagan, the big fat guy. Nice, so he's got a steel axe, but it looks like he's not on a throne or anything like that, so he's going to actually move around. So I may, I can't really just stand by and pick him off. Um, other than that, it looks like everyone just has generic items. No drops, no nothing. No, Yeah, that's going to be pretty easy. Alright, so let's do this. Alright, who are we going to bring? Where are we going to bring up this question? Okay, Marcus, you stay back. I don't need you. Hmm, you look like you've some experience with battle. No need to conceal it. I've fought many a battle in my time, I assure you. Let me tell you one thing about combat, though. The most important thing is technique. If you've no skill, you'll rarely strike your enemy. My instructor gave me this secret book a long ago. It will improve the fighting prowess of one who reads it. I'm too old to make use of it, so why don't you take it? Ooh, secret book. Oh, no, I gotta discard something? Ugh, lame. I just bought this, too. Alright, whatever. Maybe I should have looked at that beforehand. Alright, so let's look at the secret book. Increases skill by two points. Vanishes after use. Okay, very good. Um, let's get you to check out the vendor. How many items do you have? You got two items. Okay. Vendor. This is a general store. Oh, great. <laughs> huh, by the vulnerary that I just lost. You know, I might as well. I just wasted 300 bucks. Lame. Alright, wait here. Alright, let's have these big guys go up towards the front. It's really important to trust your companions, yes? If you have a boon companion fighting at your side, you feel stronger and more confident. Hmm? Who do I think make good companions for whom? Well, I'm a fortune teller, so I could do a reading, but... Hmm. Fortune teller. Not a fortune teller. Alright. Let's move on. Alright, so here they all come. Barter's a fighter, and Dorcas is another fighter. Okay, so I got two fighters on my team. Uh, how much is this going to do? You're going to do six. How about you? What are you going to do? You're going to do 12. I guess we could just double team this guy. And next 12. Okay, let's do it. Everyone get some experience off this bandit, especially you. There we go, HP, luck, and speed. Great. Alright, you can go in. Actually, you know what? Here, we're supposed to go in this house. I saw them, I did! About a month ago, Marques Ferre and his men passed right through here. They've all gone missing, haven't they? A group that as strong as that just up and vanishing? Couldn't have been bandits, but I don't believe it. it. Must have been something terrible. The world's become a dangerous place it has. Alright, moving on. Alright, you will go down as well. Do you have a hand axe, Dorcas? No, you don't. Where's this guy gonna go? He's got a sword, so he's going to have the advantage over any of my guys. Either way. Let's see what they got. Whew, he hit me twice. Yikes. That is definitely not good. Alright, how much HP do you have? You have seven? I think I can pick you off. Oh, six. Come on. Sword. I'm going to bring this lance guy. You know what? 
Pella would just destroy this guy. Ooh, with a crit. Yikes. Whew. My goodness. Alright, low and moving on. Now, I've got no form of recovery, so I need to make sure that I use these forts wisely. Use force wisely! <laughs> Let me know if you guys know where that one's from. <laughs> bah, he puts up a good fight for a pampered noble pump. It's up to me to finish him. Okay, oh, whoa, whoa. Okay, it look, looks exactly what I said. They're all gonna come down. How many are there? This looks... Hey, what's going on over there? Looks like some rough business. You, soldier, are you just gonna stand there and watch? Who do you think you are? This is Santa Ruz. What occurs here is no affair of any foreign lording. I believe I'm gonna have to disagree with you. You see, the man they're attacking happens to be a, happens to be a friend of mine. A friend? What? <laughs> Sorry, but I'm in a hurry. Yeah, look at these guys. <laughs> Ew, that's terrible. I loathe violence. Nicely done, my lord. You're a born fighter. I cannot condone resorting to force so quickly. Chastise me later, Oswin. First, we deal with these brigands. Come, we must help Elliewood. Help Elliewood? Sounds like a convenient excuse for more violence. Oswin! Yes, yes, I'm coming. Matthew, take Sarah and find some place to hide. What? With Sarah? No, I'm going with you. You are not. You'll slow us down. Oh, how rude. Oswin, let's go. Nice. Here we go. Getting some recovery. Okay, so Oswin. Yeah, Big Hector. Nice. Alright, he's got the wolf bile, which is cool. Awesome. And then we have... Oops, sorry. Oswin. There we go. Level 9 knight. Wow, level 9. Holy cow, he's strong. Probably nothing... Yeah. Great. Awesome. Alright, let's see. Wait, what defense? Okay, there's... So if I go in a forest, I'll be a little bit... I'll defend easier. But house? A house, not so much. I'll get 20 evasion. Mm -hmm. Or I can just go up and kill this guy really quick. How strong are you? Will you be able to knock this guy out in one hit? We'll hit him 17. That's fine, let's go. Let's hit him 17. And let's go to animations really quick. Barter doesn't need. Dorcas doesn't need. Oswin, yeah, let's turn him on. You know what, let's turn everyone on. Oh, wrong guy. Yikes. Hmm. Whoopsies. Wow. That's okay. We're just gonna have to see what's gonna happen now. Okay. Iron bow. Do it. Six potentially. Yikes. How about this next guy? Where's he going? Alright. So, I'm gonna stand right here. And I'm not gonna attack because I need to make sure that my iron sword is equipped because these guys are coming. Alright, jab him right in the chest and then dodge his hit. Dorcas? A barter. Yeah, throw an axe at him. There you go. Leveling up. Alright, now... Oh, he can still actually hit Rebecca. Yikes. 
Alright, you know what? We'll be fine. Here. If he tries to hit Rebecca, he'll end up going through Marcus. Alright, pick him off, what, two? That's nothing. He's lucky he's still alive. And he'll hit me one? Wow. Even though... Holy cow. What's this guy gonna do? Ten against me? Ooh, yeah, right. Bam! Right on Dorcas. Alright, here they all come. Yeah, Hector's gonna be awesome. I can already tell. Hector just single-handedly took down all those guys. Here. And finished. With a good level up. Come on, give me some good stats, buddy. I'm counting on you. Three, good. Strength and defense. That's exactly what you need. Thank you. Alright, you can go into this house. The Marquess who leads Santa Cruz is Lord Hellman. He doesn't ask for much, and he's a nice enough fellow. I wouldn't call him weak, but he is more follower than leader. Lately, he's been meeting with Marquess Laos quite a lot. I hope nothing bad comes of it, but... Alright, but... Alright, finally Rebecca gets a kill. Bam! Look at that, you're already a level up above, um... <laughs> Ellawood now. Alright, Ellawood. Item, energy ring. Increases magic or strength and defense. Well, let's look at Ellawood. What are his stats? His defense is 6, his strength is 5. Let's do that. Item. Energy ring. Use it on him. There we go. Strength increased. Excellent. Uh, so he's got a sword. We could javelin him. But then everyone else is going to start attacking me. So let's just sword it up. This is our defensive line right here. Alright, we're bum rushing him. <laughs> What's this guy gonna do? Absolutely nothing? Ooh, wow, seven. Oh, and I missed him. Oh, of course. 714. Yikes. Whoa, how did you hit through 25%? That's crazy. Lucky guy, huh? Too bad he died. Alright, what are you gonna do? Oh, yeah, that's right. You can't hit through 27. But the other guy, lo and behold, hit through, um, 25. I don't know how he did that. Hacks. Come on, Lowen. Good, good. There we go. We need that. Okay. Uh, what do you have? Attack with the Raper. Here. Okay, so I could do that. Well, let's find out how much Rebecca's gonna do to him. Seven? Mm, not bad. Why well, we hand axe him first? We can try! Nope. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't worth it. Dorcas, hit him? No, I need to kill this guy. Oh, 
about I just javelin him? Oh, come on, really? Wow, I need to get a crit or something. Do you have a um, vulnerary to use? Alright, so now we gotta figure out how we're gonna destroy this guy. Alright, so I just hope that I get a critical hit on this guy. And I don't. Nope, no crit there either. Uh oh, this is tough. Dorcas, 14, and this guy can pick him off for three, so Dorcas needs to run the heck out of there. Or you know what? Here. Got it. See, that's why you're here. So you trade with Dorcas. Here, take a vulnerary. Wait. Dorcas. Go ahead and use the vulnerary. Recover yourself. And then, let's bring on Hector and his buddy. Bring it on. What's gonna happen? Oh, okay, he's not aiming for Dorcas. Thank God. Oh, but you will for seven. Oh my god, wow. How did you dodge an 80% attack? Dorcas, you rock. Alright, well. You know what, let's do it. It's okay, you can hit me second. I need the experience. Where's the boss gonna go? Thanks. He's got an axe. So I'm gonna hit him with a sword. There we go. Okay, let's wait until this guy comes. Or you know what, Zagan? Ready, let's go. Brianna, what are you gonna do? Oh! Curses! What are you waiting for? Let me show you boys how it's done. Oh, good miss. Thank God. One. And not two. Wow. Pick off this guy a little bit. Oh, nice crit. 5, 10, 15. Way to go, buddy. Alright, let's defeat this guy. Can I actually talk to him? Yeah, I can. I know I'm super excited to go see. Alright, let's do it. Let's go talk to Hector. Elliwood, are you alright? Hector, what are you... Later, first, let's take care of these louts. Right. Okay. Alright. Where's he going? Alright, he's gonna attack you. <gasps> Oh my god. That was crazy. 18, are you joking? You're gonna be 7. Possibly hit you 13. 
Alright. Let me kill this guy. So this is our first encounter with a moving boss, which is nuts. Hmm, nice try. Alright, Elowood, finish the job. Or, you know what, Hector? Elowood, you're level 3. Hector, you're level 2. You could do it. Maybe not. That's not really a favorable matchup. Yep. Ooh, poke him right in the stomach. Oh, oh, our, this was not so easy as it seemed. Ugh, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> All right, there we go. Look at that, a plus four. Way to go. And that concludes it. Phew, is that all of them? Hector, where did you come from? Well met, Elliwood. Yes, but what are you doing here? You wound me. What do you mean? You're looking for your father, right? Why didn't you send word? Your brother was just named Marques Ostia. He's going to be very busy setting up his court council. Lord Uther must need your support. You're his brother, after all. My brother is not so weak. Oh, he has mentioned some things in public, but he knew exactly what I was going to be planning, and he let me go. Is that so? Well then, it would be unwise to refuse his kindness. It does me good to hear you, Hector. Thank you. Think nothing of it. You know Oswin, don't you? Well met, Lord Elliwood. It is good to see you again, Oswin. So you came as well. Yes, Lord Uther was worried about Lord Hector traveling alone. I've been ordered to keep a close eye on him. Ha ha ha, of course. Good to have you with us. Lord Hector, why didn't you tell me the fighting was done? I apologize for the interruption. I couldn't restrain her any longer. Are these your companions, Hector? Oh, yes, I suppose they are. One might have hoped for better, but... That was uncalled for. I can't believe you said that. Matthew, did you hear what he said about you? Me? He was talking about you. Hector, why don't you introduce us? The noisy one is Sarah. Believe it or not, she's a cleric. Yes, I'm Sarah, my lord. Pleased to meet you. And that's Matthew. He does a lot of sneaking around. My lord. Sneaking around. Well, I, uh, gather information, open doors, chests, and such. I've got nimble fingers. That sounds like a thief's work. Well, don't let it worry you, but this journey, I suspect it'll be harder than you imagine. You may have to accept things like this if you want to survive. What is it, Hector? Do you know something? Nothing specific. Rumors abound, though. A league of assassins from Burn has been moving around in Lycia. Experienced bounty hunters and mercenaries are vanishing. That reminds me, one of the men who attacked us said something odd. What was it? Lord Elliwood, if I may. Marcus, good to see you. Lord Hector, it's been far too long. Your assistance is greatly appreciated. Come now, Marcus. No need for such formalities. Tell me what you heard. Of course, the apparent leader of that gang of thugs. He indicated that someone was watching Lord Elliwood. That someone needed him dead. Hmm, that's troubling. Actually, a captain of the guard was watching the fight when we arrived. He was a knight of Santa Ruz. And yet he just stood there and let a lord be attacked. I think he was planning on seeing you die. So, what do you think? You might be right. Something may have happened to Lord Hellman, too. Come, we must hurry to the castle. Elowood, who is this? This is Abdallah Nation. I require tactical aid in my search in the search for my father, and Oh, I see, so this is who directed the battle plan back there, hmm? You know, you're very young. We've many strategists in Ostio, but none so young. Hollywood. Are you sure about this one? Abdallah Nation is a student of military strategy, but we've received nothing but sound advice so far. Abdallah Nation has my trust. 
All right, I suppose I shall witness your skills firsthand. Well met. Hello, how have you been, Abdallah? Hey, my secret's revealed. Oh, that, yes, it's true. My guise as a common thief was but a ruse. I served House Ostia for some time as a spy of sorts. Surprised? Well, regardless, it looks like we're be we'll be traveling again. Here's to our mutual survival. Hee! Abdallah Nation, is that really you? It's been far, far too long. You missed me, didn't you? Of course you did. I knew it. Hmm, didn't I tell you before? I'm in the employ of Ostia, Lycia's ruling territory. I'll be here to help you just like before. Aren't you lucky? Alright, birds of a feather. Saving, and we're going on to the next chapter. Okay, so that was a pretty good one. I'm glad that we have Hector aboard, and I can't wait to start leveling up that uh, that knight. I think uh, I think that's going to be pretty fun. And having a cleric back and Matthew, our band of mercenaries is coming back together. So uh, we'll see you on the next episode.